name is Hector Velasquez and welcome to GCS AA Inside the Shop. Is your engine sounding a little bit like that? Well, in today's episode, we're going to be talking about governors in a four-stroke engine and how important they are to making sure that your engine is running at full optimum. All right, so the governor is like cruise control in your car. It helps maintain consistent engine speed despite in the load changes. If you're going uphill or downhill, that motor is going to maintain a consistent RPM. Okay, so let's look at some of the components that make up the gear assembly. Here's the governor gear, flyweights, governor cup, here we have the governor cross shaft, and the governor arm. Now how will you know your governor needs adjusting? Well, your engine will either run too slow or low RPMs or high RPMs or it may surge up and down like this. One thing you want to do is just go ahead and check your governor arm, your spring, make sure everything's attached. Sometimes they come loose that you can easily just put them back on as long as your spring is in good shape. All right, now what happens is as your engine runs, as the crankshaft turns, it's also turning the governor gear and the flyweights by centrifugal force push on that governor cup. That governor cup then pushes on the governor cross shaft, the governor arm, and that's what opens and closes the throttle and the carburetor. Now let's talk about how we would adjust the engine governor. Well, you want to loosen up the governor arm from the shaft, real easy. Next, you want to hold the throttle full open or wide open. Then you want to pay attention to the direction of the governor arm. That's the direction we want to turn the shaft. What that's doing, it's pushing up that little paddle up against the governor cup. You want to go ahead and tighten that down. Make sure your governor arm and throttle linkage moves freely and then take it out for a test. Well, as you can see, having your governor properly adjusted is important to your engine's longevity and efficiency. Well, I want to thank you for joining me here today on DCS AA Inside the Shop, where we're helping technicians one wrench at a time.